Why did I do now? You didn't do anything. You never do anything. Oh my gosh, this cheeseburger looks amazing. Can you let, I can do this. Just, I know you can't how. do anything on your own. I know. I literally have to wipe you five It minutes. doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <gasps> You're so <gasps> Look what you did. You did it. Why would you spill the food? I'm gonna throw something at you right now. I'm literally gonna, I'm gonna take that glass and shatter it over your head. Click the link below and get yourself a cameo where I'll make a special video just for you. Treat yourself or surprise someone else. It makes a great gift. Link below. Turn it off then if you're going to be this way. This is supposed to be a... I'm not being anywhere. This is how we normally are. I want my chips. You sprayed my chips all over the place. Great. great. Now I'm going to start. I hate you. Yeah, I'm going to start. You'll be on starting. Great. Great. Now I'm gonna start. Oh, thank God they gave me garlic starve. sauce. I need garlic sauce. Thanks. Yeah, because you need more fat in your body. These garlic sauces, by the way, are so good. Mm. Mm. And where's my shish kebab? In there. Oh, here it is, yeah. Oh, these. Okay, this is kind of sad. It's supposed to be cheese loaded. Should I bring you cheese, sweetie? I don't know. Orland has Wendy's, but there's like no room. Oh, they didn't have the right item for Wendy's. Just to make this day even better. Ooh. This piece of garbage has Ooh. been awful today. Can you stop blaming me for everything? How about you take accountability? Now that you don't blame everyone how about for everything you, that goes wrong in your life. How about you put in your weight game? How about you look at yourself in the mirror and say, oh gee, I might contribute to why our marriage is always having issues. Well, it all started when you cheated on me 12 times. Oh my God, get out of the past. Get out of the past. It was seven years ago. I if still you live with the repercussions. I still have to go to a doctor for your mistakes. Or, I don't even know how your chili's gonna fit here. Oh, who cares? I just wanna get it off camera. No, we're doing this video together. Do you live in this house? Barely. Do you have to Barely. Barely. We don't to... even sleep together. When's the last time we slept together? Shut up. Shut up. Shut your mouth. It's disgusting. He makes me so angry. Ugh. Why is he in my life? Why is he in my life? Every day there's something. Every day there's something. And I know all the neighbors are listening. Oh! Every day. Every mother. and have a normal, not one normal day. Does anyone relate to my situation? Oh, but you're famous. Oh, but you make money eating food. Oh, you have no worries. I'm just like you people. I live with another human being and there's fights about everything. <sighs> and now my health is failing because he's stressing me. Here, give me the scissors. We're gonna make this nice. Can you put styrofoam in the... Of course not. You can't put styrofoam in the microwave? Why? No, unless you wanna eat the styrofoam. What? It melts. No, it do does... Can you put... No, it's only metal you can't put You learn something. This has potatoes, french fries... Oh, I'm gonna try french fries, actually. Mm. Try a sausage. And a sausage. Mm. It needs cheese, though. Mm. Mm. Maybe put cheese on it. Put the mozzarella, put it in the microwave. Yeah, I'll put it on Can the Can you put, touch my face? Yeah, actually, I'll just put in the cheese in the bowl. There goes Why? You're supposed to put it on there so it like... I'll bring it in a bowl and you can... Like we do with the ramen. Then it won't incorporate with the ingredients. All right, all right. If you're so concerned, throw it all on a black plate. And people are like, oh, you're the aggressor. 
You have no idea what I live through off camera. Oh, but you're acting. Oh, you're putting on a skit for YouTube. At this rate, it's far from that. I know what everyone's saying. I know, I see them. I see the comments. And yes, I like to be funny sometimes, like, <gasps> and you know, I'll plan my farts. I can't fart on purpose, let me try. Yeah, I can't do it. But sometimes if I know the farts coming, I feel it. I'm like, oh, let's make it funny. I'm, I'm a comedian, I like to have fun. But that's so I can get myself through the day. And then my real problems start bleeding into my YouTube problems. And then this is my life. He's... It's so crazy. Like, I've never hated anyone more than the person I married. Ladies. Anyone out there agree? Chippers. And where's the French? Where's the... Whatever. He can starve. He got Wendy's for himself. I got these, which I'm really excited about. Okay. I'm just going to eat without him. I'm just going to... I'm just going to eat without him. Trying to make this look a little presentable. That's, I'm really happy about the garlic sauce. Hi everyone, I'm so sorry. Every day there's something in, in, in this, in this mukbanging. There's always something every day. So this here has mozzarella cheese. <gasps> mozzarella cheese, like three heavy slices of it with garlic sauce, crushed potato chips, shredded beef, shredded pork, shredded chicken with pineapple sauce, cashew drizzle, on a massive bun for only eight dollars you spend that on a thing at wendy's practically which uh, that's his i'm not gonna open what oh they ran out of pubs you know how they just came out with their pubs again their pub pretzel pretzel pub they don't have any more greens they don't have any more fries they don't have more beer pub sauce it's only like 6 p.m welcome to america where we don't have anything anymore oh oh Oh, but apparently that's the whole world, isn't it? There's people to blame, but they're not held accountable because our hands are tied. Because we depend on people to make our stuff because we're lazy Americans. You can't bite the hand that feeds you. Literally. Oh, that's so good. All right. I'm just gonna start, I'm gonna start with some shish kebab. This here is real meat. Real, honest to God meat. Focusing for you. This blasted camera, I'm about to chuck it out the window. <sighs> Can you see? I want people to see. You know, I paid for this, so I want people to see. Why is it? That's it? Yep. That's it? What do you want? I wanted treat cheese shredded all over it, and you just put one glob on it. You idiot! Well, what else am I you, to do? you ate all the cheese. What do you mean? What are you supposed to do? We have a whole bag of shredded cheese. You ate it. You take the shredded cheese and you sprinkle it evenly on top, so it's like a blanket. Would you just put it in a ball and throw it on top and say, "Ooh, then what's the point of putting it on another plate?" You stupid freak! You ate all the cheese. This is all we got in the freezer. No, it's not. I don't want it now. It's his fault. So you owe me twenty dollars because you're inept. I'm so over you. I'm over you. Let's break up. Can you please touch the beef for the peasants? You say please now. Touch the beef. If you pour into your fat face. Well, I'm covering my face. It looks like a moon. Oh. It's the best tasting beef ever. Sit, eat. Let's do it. Not bang. So we're supposed to pretend that everything's okay? No, we're not. Are you including all that garbage? Gosh. 
<clears throat> They're awful. What price on this, Elise? Eat your own food! Mmm. Mmm. Actually, I want to try the chip. Oh my god, and a quail egg? I need some quail. These are quail eggs. Yeah, I've actually been craving eggs. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh, look at how fresh this looks. It looks fresh. I like Wendy's because the, the burgers always look fresh. That looks nothing compared to mine. Want to try it? Look, I got two quail eggs. Mmm. 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 And I actually love. Mm. I love the sausage. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Alleluia. Mm. Try. What? We have to be balanced. I don't want to try. I'm mad at you. Every day you cause me stress and you come on camera and we're supposed to act like we're happy. And then they say we're acting. What about all the stress I'm you cause me every I'm single day? You give me stress every single day. I have to do everything for you. You can't even wipe. You can't feed yourself. Wait, I'm doing a, I'm doing a, a bite, so just shut it. Mm. Take a look. Shredded beef, shredded chicken. We have shredded pork, mozzarella cheese. And we also have um, crushed potato chips, pink sauce, mayo, and this, this is massive as well. Oh my god! Now I need my cheesy arepa. Ooh. This is made out of cheese. It's, well, it's cheese on top of a corn pancake type of thing. Oh, that looks really good. <laughs> Stop it, Arch! You're disgusting. You waste food. That hurt. Good. How about you show them how bald you are? Swallow. What? <laughs> Stop! Stop. Ah. Leave me alone! You're doing this because you can get away with it on camera. I know exactly what you're doing! Stop! 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 Stop!
click the link below to follow my Patreon. You'll get exclusive weekly videos about my life, plus tons of mukbangs not allowed on YouTube. Link below. Stop! 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 I'm trying to eat my food! I'm eating back here now. Hi, I'm eating back here now. Good, you might fit on the frame now. We're divorcing. I know we're divorcing. I know we are. Look at you, you're so fat, you can't even sit in a chair. I got fat because of you. I was skinny when you met me. Boo hoo. That's every married couple. I'm looking for these quail eggs. They barely live in. I'm gonna have some of the cheese. Ooh. At least I got the healthy option. I got your ranch, by the way, because you wanted it. Yeah, for things that aren't here. Oh, yeah, they messed up the order. Woohoo. Welcome to fast food. You don't even fit anymore. Neither of us do. Especially you. Mm. Okay. More meat, quality meat for my brain, so I don't rot like. You don't have one of those. Hmm. <sighs> You should have just left. You should have just left you on that cabbage farm. Let's change the subject. I'm actually not gonna talk to you the rest of the day. Too bad there's no return policies on adoptions. Talk to them. No. You. We have so much to say right now, so keep going. I have nothing to say. Yeah. Oh, sounds like it. What am I supposed to say? That I love you? I don't love you. That I've been faithful? Have not been faithful. Anyways, I'm gonna try this hot dog. This hot dog has shredded beef, shredded chicken on top of a pork sausage with shredded chips on top Pineapple sauce and quail eggs. God forbid you have a salad. Take a look, peasants, take a look. It's actually amazing. This is typical uh, Spanish food. They can't even see. Half of them are diabetic, too. The Colombian fish. Okay, it's also really big. Huh. Oh. You wish yours was top that size, but it can't even get. It can't Just be quiet, I'm eating! Yeah. This is so good. I'm, I, I, can't even, I can't even scream or moan, it's so good. <clears throat> it hooks. Uh, you can't have me breathe, though. Hey, Orlin, you want to. No! 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 You want to take a shower? No! No! You want no. to take a shower? You want to take a shower? Then shut your mouth. Let go. Let no. go. Let go. Are you gonna stop? I'll punch you. Are you gonna stop? Are you gonna stop? Yes. Stop. I'm stopping.
better stop. Anyway, whatever I was saying, this is, I mean, you know, I, I should just stop going to fast food, honestly. I need to start making food at home. I need to go into like mom and pops because they have better stuff. Why do I keep going? Like if I want a nice chili cheese hot dog, there's Wiener Schnitzel, there's Sonic, there's Checkers, there's um, Fat Burger. There's all these places to get chili cheese hot dog. Really? None of them compared to this at all. This is three types of meat with potatoes with two types of sauces and quail eggs. And it's double the size. And the same price for the little diddly tiddly wink you get anywhere else. I mean, look at this thing. Ah. And there's mustard. That shredded beef on top of the pork. <sighs> Shout out to my friend Hungry Fat Chick. She loves a hot dog. And good for her. She doesn't do much fast. Well, she, I guess she kind of does for YouTube. But she she's all about going to the restaurants to get restaurant stuff. It's better. <clears throat> mm. You should just admire this, people. Just look at that and admire it. Oh, my God. <sighs> okay, so this is yours. What is this? I got it for you. Oh, is that that bourbon thing? Yeah. I'm currently with my quail egg. Well, I ate all the eggs, huh? Good. Meat. Huh. Okay, let's see. Oh, it actually looks kind of nice. So this here is the Wendy's bourbon with extra mayo and extra bourbon sauce. Bacon, by the way. I'm gonna show you how to pull up. Oh, dang! They filled that up good! Did you know something? I think I heard something. It landed on here. Was it crumb? Oh, it's probably a crumb. I'm excited for you to try it. I got it for you. Oh, we're all nice now? Look at that, by the way. Actually, just look at that. Well, that looks like five guys. What the heck? Wow. What the heck? They That's put, really sloppy. That's sloppy. Mm. Exactly how I requested. I asked for extra fried onions, extra bourbon sauce, and extra uh, ranch sauce or mayo sauce, whatever it was. That looks really good. I'm like shaking. Oh gosh. I just want them to see this. Oh my God. Wendy's. This is caramelized sweet bourbon. Oh, dang. And the fried onions are falling out everywhere. Oh my God. Mm. Okay, here I go. <sighs> oh, that's a good bun too. Mm. I like this more. It's also double the size. Look at how massive this is, but. Same price, yeah. Same price, yeah. yeah. But that's how fast food is. I also got fast food the other day. You're like, the other day, Nick, every day, I know. Um, I'm always looking at fast food. The prices are going up. When I first started my mukbang career, there was an actual dollar menu. Places. Taco Bell's value menu, they have one thing that's a dollar. And it's a tortilla with some cheese on it. It's called a cheese roll up. Everything else is two or two fifty or three. That's their value. I'm like, oh my god. I mean, I don't think I don't care if prices come up, but pay better come up. Yeah, you feel me? You try. I'm just being quiet. I'm good. Come a little closer so I can see you. Mm. It's sweet. It really is. I'm loving this beef. So much more than anything else. I want to try this. Mm -hmm. This is massive. 
I love real beef. Why don't I eat actual steak on mm. camera? I, is it better than that, huh? Yeah. I know. Oh my god. Three types of meat, three slices of mozzarella. Mmm. And garlic sauce. Uh, did you, it's the best sauce. Yeah, I'm gonna put some french fries. What do you think of the french fries, by the way? Good. We're gonna dip those into that garlic sauce because that garlic sauce is very good. Oh. Oh. Mm. I know their french fries are greasy. Mm. That garlic sauce is so amazing. Now, grab, grab a clump of cheese, a clump of hot dog, and a clump of french fry. Mmm, you should do that. I already did. Mmm. Potato. Mmm. Mm. Cheese. Hot dog. Mmm. Wow. So good. My favorite part was that shish kebab, shish kebab. That's my favorite way to eat tender, juicy, melt in your mouth beef and grilled onions. But, ooh, delicious. I should have gotten another one of those, to be honest. Gosh, but I'm trying to think like, if I would have just chose the burger or the hot dog, what would I have chosen? What, what do you like better, burger or hot dog? Burger. Then I get hot dogs. Or I really like hot dogs. I never knew you like hot dogs. <laughs> you barely eat them. <laughs> this is better than all fast food. And it is fast food, kinda. It's Latino fast food. I probably have had like 2,000 calories in front of you. I ate almost this whole arepa. Let me have some of that. Thank you. Mm. I also feel a little sick. Like I've had too much food type of feeling. You think? But I will keep going. <laughs> Shredded, juicy beef on top of the hot dog with chips, mustard, garlic sauce, and pink sauce with eggs. This was only $5, by the way. $5! That's how much a Big Mac is. This is real beef, real egg, like whole eggs. There's an egg. There's an egg. I'm officially very full. And you're just over there drinking your soup. It's chilly. I'm almost done. Do you want to try this? I guess.
It's very good. My arm still stings, by the way. Oh. Yeah, oh. You mean a heart attack? No. By the way, I've never fully recovered from a heart attack. Never. Never. I'm told it's going to be permanent nerve damage. I've told you guys what I go through, right? So I have had two heart attacks in my life. All within three years? No, within four. One was early into my mukbang career. One was like a couple months ago, I guess, six months ago. Talked about it on camera. Everyone thought I was acting. This is Orland's chili. He orders the family size bucket. It's the only way to do it. But don't it look good? Here, I'm gonna go like this. Oh, it's so spicy and flavorful. Oh my god. It actually tastes very healthy. Well, I saw a person on YouTube compare all the chilies. Freddy's, Culver's, have you had any of those? Uh, Sonic, I think. Sonic sells chili? No. Don't they, they have, have chili in there? They have chili spread that they put on top of like oh, hot I dogs. Have, I think Not I have, like chili, chili cheese chili. Um, <laughs> steak and shake, did they have chili? I think they did. Oh my god. It's good, right? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not, I've... It has meat in it too. The spicy. Yeah, it's a good, a good type of spice. Mm. It, tastes very it feels nice. like something you could eat a lot of, whereas you go to Fat Burger, for instance, that's pure grease. And I don't think it has any dairy in it. That? I don't know. Um, anyways, I was just saying that video, the man compared a bunch, not Fat Burger, but he compared Culver's, Freddy's, mm. Wendy's, and there's one more that I can't quite think of. Who had chili? Who, who serves chili? It was one more fast food brand. Anyway, that was his favorite. Um, it was also the most cost effective, too. This is so cheap. This is like six dollars, eight dollars. Yeah, that's what he concluded. It was some older guy, not like a huge YouTuber, but he had his channel. He did few food reviews in his his man cave or his garage. It's probably in his fifties or something. He put a lot of effort into the video. He had all these cam. Maybe you guys can go look him up. He had like all these cameras and angles, and he had a system. There was a procedure that he followed: smell, taste, price. He weighed each thing. He weighed them. Divided up the ounces per the cost. He did cost price per ounce. He smelled them. He tasted them. He did all. It was kind of cool. Anyways, Wendy's was his favorite. The end. I've always loved Wendy's chili. When I first came to the U.S. and I went to Wendy's, I had chili and I fell in love. Cause we don't eat beans like this in Colombia. This is like unique. Mm. It's very good. I'm very full. But if there is more shish kebab beef. I'd eat another whole shish kebab, just shove it in. Mm. Dang, this this was really tasty. I'm gonna have another bite of this. It's so good. <coughs> mm. <sighs> I miss when we loved each other. It's fine. You guys are really full. I'm so full. I actually feel like... <sighs> well... I'm just still eating this. It's so amazing. I'm not okay. They know. That's crazy. People are always talking about the internet. Like he eats all this food. I've never. I mean, yes, there's the frequency issue I've had, but I've never been someone that eats that much food in a city. Maybe at first, when I first quit being a vegan years ago, and I was just ready for everything. Um, but in general, I've always, always left food on the display when I'm done the video. The yeah. only time that doesn't happen is maybe ramen noodles, because it's my favorite meal to eat. Maybe 
But the amount of butter and cheese I throw into those things nowadays, even still, I can't finish. Again, maybe back in the day when I first quit vegan and I didn't know about the butter and I would just have like five packs and I was like, oh yeah, I can finish this. But most times, and people review me, they look at my thumbnails, they're like, oh, look at all he eats. And all the, <clears throat> my fans, you peasants know, you say in the comments, oh, I watch Nikocado, he barely, he, okay, I don't wanna say barely. I definitely eat to my, to my like stuff, to eat to my heart's content. I don't sit here and count calories on a calculator, but I never finish everything. I finish. God, that was so annoying. Scrape, 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 scrape. That's what you're supposed to do. Just drink it at that point. Who drinks the chili? Oh wait. There's probably competitive eaters that too. <laughs> Anyways, I don't eat that much. I mean, I eat a lot. I eat more than most people. 390 pounds. When you eat in private, you wear in public. But I don't eat fast and I don't eat a ton in a city. Like, look at Hungry Fat Chick, same with her. I mean, like, she's big too, but she'll have one burger and a couple fries and be done. I'm not a food competitive eater. Mm. I just want more shish kebab. To be honest. I can get you more. Will you? Mm hmm Really? Are they open? Yeah. I kind of want one more, actually. Just that. I just want that meat. I just want that straight up meat. Like, this is all good, but it's, it's I'm getting sickened from all the sugar and all the... I don't know. You know what I mean? It's been so many years since I've had, like, straight up... I never filmed that. Ever! There's people that do ASMRs that are like, steak. But I'm always afraid no one's, you know, gonna care to watch me eat it, so I'm like, oh, why bother? Maybe I could be become a steak muck bunker. <sighs> That'd be cool. Anyways, I'm gonna say goodbye. My hands are sticky. No. He just threw food at me. What's on your football? I want more meat. <coughs> Can I have mine? No. You're so ugly. No. Hi. <clears throat> Changed my shirt. <laughs> I am going to. <clears throat> I'm very happy. <laughs> I got some meat. <laughs> very healthy. <laughs> I actually think it, it could be healthy. <laughs> I don't believe it. It's he said it's like uh, conspiracy, the Kellogg's brothers, you know, trying to get us to eat things that were man-made, that you know, are processed in a factory, is better than eating something naturally occurring. I don't know. Everyone has their things and reasons. Oh, let me put it back on here and keep it hot. <clears throat> He's like, I would never tell someone to avoid eggs or some or fish or whatever to. 
the cholesterol thing, it's all propaganda, blah, 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 big pharma, whatever he said. Ooh. Comes with fries? Okay. Ooh. Oh, man. Got an onion and got, you could give me a little more onion than that. But look at the beef. Ooh. Oh, man. Okay, let's go into it. It's so juicy. Sorry. <laughs> mm. Mm. They better not add like oil onto this. I'm hoping this is like real honest to God grease from the animal. Oil and camel water, thanks. Bye. Bring me water, please. I'm lazy. Got the onion. Ooh. Oh my god. Water? Watch this. Why should I watch you? Oh my god. It's so hot. And juicy. Sorry, and the like moaning and everything. I don't even want the french fries, and these are great french fries. Here, you have the french fries. I want the french fries. You want them? They're hot. Eat them while they're hot. Do you want them? Later. They'll be cold. I'll full. Okay. Last piece. I'm already on my last piece. Oh, goodness. Thanks for the water, even though I hate you. Hot steak, cold water. Let me tell you about the time I quit being a vegan. I was living in Colombia. And um, it, steak was not my first thing I ended it on. It was actually really hard for me to come to terms with it. I had to do some growing up. I had to do some self-reflection. I had to realize there's a lot of propaganda in the things I learned. And I had to come to terms with the fact that this world's sad. For life, other life has to cease to exist. That's the plant kingdom, that's the animal kingdom. That's the, the meteorites, everything comes from death of something. It's sad, but that's the way it's set up. Have a problem, take it up with God. Um, once I got over that, had my fish, had my eggs, and I was ready to have a steak. I remember, I went to a restaurant, here we go. I had beef just like this, and I was like, and I was happy for the whole rest of the day. My blood sugar felt stable. My mind felt stable. My anxiety just, boom, just at peace. And it's fast. I mean, think of the, the moment you have junk food. The same vegans that'd be like, oh, it doesn't work like that. You're just looking for attention. It doesn't work like that. It's not that instant. This is what they would tell me. You're acting. It's not that instant, instant instantaneous. <gasps> You don't just feel better the moment you have it and all your problems go away. You're just acting. Yeah, well, give one of those vegans, I don't know, a, a cheeseburger with like, you know, extra cheese and deep fried. this and extra soy fried this fried that fried that they're gonna feel effects too they're gonna feel like crap after the meal so you're allowed to feel a reaction from your food but i'm not allowed to feel a re reaction from my food you got a negative reaction from having your junk food but i can't get a positive reaction from having 
you know, some steak. Vignum's a religion, I don't subscribe to that religion. Oh. Anyway, I remember I was sitting at that restaurant. I ordered a steak just like this. Not on a stick, but it was, you know, on a plate. <laughs> Had some sides of little Papa Creoles, which is these little potatoes. And I just felt, huh. I'm sorry, cow. I'm so sorry. I don't know what to tell you. Mm. <laughs> Hi, <clears throat> that was wonderful. I feel happy. Is this in the same video or is this gonna be a separate video for a separate channel? I mean, it's already 10 minutes, shoot, that's the length of a video. Why do I need an extra, extra, extra long video? I just throw this on someone else. Hi guys, I don't know where I am. I'm somewhere on the internet. This might be my Patreon, who knows. No, if it's Patreon, I'd start cursing and take off my clothes because that's what I'm <laughs> joking. Um, but I'm also not. <clears throat> I don't know where this video is going to go. But that hit the spot. That's what I needed. Huh. Well, bye. I'll see you guys. I don't know. When? <sighs> Should I have one French fry? Let's have one French fry. They have the best French fries. That garlic sauce is amazing. These French fries are so good. Hi, it's me. I'd like to thank all my patrons for supporting this video and an even bigger thank you to my executive producers, Jamie Baby Cotto, Princess Abby, and C Butter. If you'd like to support my channel a little bit extra, or if you just want to see the real unfiltered side of these videos, click the link in the description box and consider joining all of us over on Patreon. You'll get to see weekly videos and a much more candid side of me. Oh, and by the way, you have to be a grown up to follow. Patreon's really for my closest followers only and new openings become available on a first come first serve basis. So if you see an opening, hurry up. And if you want to hear from me personally, get yourself a video directly from me on Cameo, where I can surprise you with a video straight to your phone or your computer. You can also hire me to tell off your friend. If you want more, check out my merch store and get yourself a Waterweight t-shirt. Patreon, Cameo, and merch are all linked in the description box. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.